In this video, I'll show you how to screen record on your Xbox Series S or X. So it's very easy. Once you're playing a game, let's say you want to record something, you're gonna press the Xbox logo on your controller once. I'm gonna have this menu and we need to go over there. Once you're in this, uh, once you selected this icon over here, we're gonna have these options and we have record what happened. This simply means that it will record what happened previously, so about 30 seconds before you press record what happened in case you missed it. And we also have start recording if you want to start recording. But there's also more options if we go down over here where it says capture settings. Click on this. We have multiple options that I think they're very useful. So what is important in this menu is over here where on the game clips, we have recording length. If we go on it, we can select how long we want to record. So we have up to a minute and under it, we have the resolution that we can change. So on the series S like mine, I can record up to uh, 1080p. Obviously there's no 4K recording since th this console does not output native 4K, it, sh it just upscales it. So that's why it's only 1080p. But you can also choose 720p, go up in recording length and then you'll unlock the three minutes recording length. This is the maximum. Uh, it's a bit of shame. I wish you were able to record for at least 15, 30 minutes. But in the case of the Series S, these are the options. With the X, I think it allows you to record longer and at a higher resolution. Over here where it says capture save location, if you have a USB 3.0 drive or maybe just a thumbstick, you can stick it in your Xbox and you'll be able to record on that drive this way when you edit this footage on your PC. Well, it's easier to just unstick it from your Xbox and go over there on and transfer it on your computer. You see right now I have nothing connected, but if you had a USB drive connected, you'll see the option. Finally, if we go down there, we have automatic uploads. This is up to you, but I think this is quite useful as well, as well because your uploads will be uploaded on your the Xbox app on your smartphone. This way you can transfer whatever you recorded on the app. If you don't want your Xbox to upload those files, you can simply select do not don't upload here and nothing will happen. The footage that you have recorded will stay on your Xbox. And finally, we and finally we also have this option over here, button mapping. I suggest you click on it. It will make everything easier. So press A. And then in this menu, make sure that share button press is selected. This small green, uh, this button over here, the middle one. And go down where it says take screenshot, and you want to press A. And instead of take a screenshot, you're gonna select start stop recording once this is selected you can exit this menu by pressing b just going back to the game and now every time you're going to press this button let me show you it will say recording started so now you can play and everything is recorded like this and once you're done, you can also press this button again and it will say recording stopped. Then to view whatever you just recorded, you're gonna press the Xbox logo, gonna go over here again, and you're gonna go down and select recent captures. And here you're gonna find everything that got recorded. You can press A to visualize and uh, it will play whatever you just saw. And this is it. This is how you screen capture on your Xbox Series S or Series S. If this was helpful, please leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.